Hey guys, it's Liz and we're flipping things and today we're unboxing things which a mystery box. <laughs> it's not actually a mystery box. No, it is a mystery because we don't It's a mystery inside. to you. I know it's inside. We don't no. you tell me. Surprise. <laughs> we are unboxing another order from bulk.com. Um, this one was ordered through eBay, so the listings are already created for me, which is super awesome. Um, so stay tuned and let's, let me show you guys what's inside. Okay, welcome back guys. Um, I am glad you're all here. I, a few weeks back, placed an order for a bulk.com manifested box i got a box of sporting goods and it was mostly camping gear that i ordered directly through like and subscribe, the... like and subscribe if you'd like and, and, leave comments. and leave a comment trevor really loves the comments and he's in first grade so he just do he does he has just learned to read this year so he actually really helps read the comments and he gets very excited when he finds his name anyways let me get back to what's important I placed an order. It went directly through eBay. Um, so I, I placed the order through eBay. Um, it got here very quickly. And then once I was done going through the box um, and photographing everything, and these are um, new, brand new items, all the listings were already started for me on eBay. So all I had to go in and do was basically download the listings, add my photos in, make some edits to the categories because those weren't quite right. So some minor edits, but it was significantly easier than starting from scratch. Like I was really impressed with the process and I wasn't sure like if I just got really lucky that time or what, because but the first time I ordered from bulk, I got the untested returns and that box was a bit of a disaster. I don't recommend it. You've got to be a big gambler on the untested returns. <laughs> stuff from bulk and I'm just not that big of a gambler anymore. So this is another box of sporting goods. Again, at this time it's more sporting goods. They have a lot of like clothes and things like that. I had to search for a while to find this one. And this box was $109. It was actually originally listed at $139. And I put it on my watch list and I left it alone. And within 24 hours, I don't know if it's, I'm sure it's not because I put it on the watch list, but within 24 hours, I got an alert from eBay that basically said, um, they had dropped the price on this $30. So it went down to 109 and I was all over it. I just purchased it right away. So it was $109. I can't remember exactly how many items are in the box, but I know, um, it's $30 for shipping and it came out to like $3 and five cents per item. So... Let's open. Without further ado, let's open the mystery box. Let's open the mystery to Trevor box. It is a mystery to Trevor. I kind of know what's in here. Um, and I am just so excited about the ease of doing the listings on these because I am like a procrastinator and I wind up getting um, behind on my listing. I love to source and... I can't be trusted to list as consistently as I should. And i that's on me. I know that. Um, but I also have like little ones, right? That I'm teaching full time. They're on spring break this week. Um, all right. So there's a, lot of stuff. there's a lot of stuff. This is looking good. I'm going to just sort of let you guys sort of peek in and see what I'm seeing. Yeah. Um, there's stuff on now, the bottom that we can't. There's stuff on the bottom we can't see. I will mention, I have three sons. My oldest is 18, he's a musician. He's not really you know, in need of sports equipment. But my 10 year old, who is going to be 11 tomorrow, um, he's a soccer player, a hockey player. He plays all the sports. Um, and both boys just got signed up for Little League this summer. So I knew- I play soccer, I play um, hockey. You play hockey and you're signed up for Little League baseball and soccer. A lot of sports in this house. So I knew no matter what, like if this box, if there was stuff in there that wasn't going to move or if there was anything that had issues that I have three boys and um, I knew I could use the stuff for them. So up first, we've got volleyball knee pads. 
looks like a Walmart's. If I know Walmart's clearance tag, that looks like a Walmart clearance tag. But these are the Franklin brand volleyball knee pads. These are fine, perfect, beautiful condition. Um, looks like here is enough. Well, I'm just doing the same thing. So there's another one of those. I know there's multiple items. Trevor, do you want to pull something out? Some shin guards. So these are Franklin shin guards. I do know Franklin's not the greatest sports brand, I think but Matthew has them. Matthew has very. He might actually have the same pair. Um, we are coming. These are size up to five foot three. We are coming into soccer season, and so. These are good, and I think there's actually multiple pairs of shin guards, which I like um, because they're all the same size. It's one listing with multiple um, Three? quantity of the same listing, which is super easy to... Now, this one is smaller. This is up to four foot seven. So they, these actually might be Trevor's. These might be yours for when you start soccer. Give me them right now. Give me them right now. Um, I'm trying to get out all of the shin guards if I can find them, but there are a lot. If I remember, there are a lot. So, hmm. oh, I found, another one. found another one. Um, these are also shin guards, but different. Another these, pair, guys. Here's another pair. These are shin guard socks, um, where the sock is basically part of the shin guard. I always like these for the little ones that have like trouble getting their own stuff on. Uh, Here's another one, another one. I'll back to the first oh, there's a lot. We're gonna sell a lot of shin guards. We're gonna have a lot of shin guards to sell. I forget how many. Oh, another one. Another one, another one. All right, uh, and... I think we're gonna pick a new one, guys. <laughs> and then one, Um, these are also shin guards. These, whoops, these are the Umbro, Umbro, Umbro brand. That's it. Tongue twister. The Umbro brand. Like, I like Umbro. Um, these were also, they were originally $12.99, clearance up to $3.89. So remember, I picked everything up for $3.30 a piece. Um, there's, oh, well, all right, this is a, um, just a soccer. Bag. Carry bag, carry sack, carry, you know, the drawstring. Matthew has a million of these. This is fine. Umbro's a good brand. Um, all right, what's this? This is a little purse. Um, it's nothing special. It is the brand A New Day. Looks like it was originally $24.99. Is this Target? I can't tell. It was originally $24.99. It was clearance out at $12. 49 but it's I mean this is a cute just little like crossbody bag I like those that was the only there was a few things in here that were not um sporting goods but we've got a cat and jack size 14 16 little shirt it's cute if you can see it it's like turquoise it's new with tags Trevor oh this is a MLS water bottle. Um, is there a price tag on this one? This one's priced at $9.99. Um, looks like it was originally $7.99 and then marked down. But again, we're coming into outdoor sports season, so that's good. Um, we've got a little... This is a really cute coat, actually. So this is a kid's winter coat. Super thick. And like lined and warm it is cat and jack as well i think so this was originally 39.99 can you see it oh. and it was clearance down to 11.99 so listen this might not sell right away because it's kind of we're going into summer it was 70 here in buffalo today oh my god what a beautiful day oh we've got some more shin guards Another one of Guys, these I'm MLS under you water right bottles. Now. Um, this is a super cute little flannel. I actually, this is Trevor's size. I might actually keep this for Trevor because this is like the cutest little red flannel shirt I ever saw. Do you like that? That's it really cute. It fits. It fits. I'm gonna try it on. Okay, try it on. Um, this is a. All in motion. You actually mean I can. 
<laughs> so it's like a um, windbreaker a coat. It's it's lightweight, but it's still kind of heavy. And it's a size medium. This is actually pretty nice. Oh, there's the tag. I was wondering where the tag was. So it's a soft shell fleece jacket. And it was originally $48. It was marked down to $14.40. We've got some baseball gloves. Oh, wait, Matthew actually I can Matthew, have these. Matthew might have the same pair, yeah. Yeah, he does. Um, youth medium baseball gloves. All mm -hmm. baseball. Mm -hmm. We've got two more. Oh, mm -hmm. lot of shingers. I just want to say it was like 19, I think, in there. How many shingers? If I remember correctly, this How is a cute... How many shingers? <laughs> is it too early for a wine? Uh, I'll get you some. Oh, no, it's okay. You don't need... right, Please don't break the wine. Oh, my God. All right, this is a cute little, little girl shirt. And it's just a little unicorn. It's also this cat and Jack. Very cute. Some little little girl's jewelry. Which, yeah. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I knew that was in there, but. All right, we've got a shirt. It looks like a little girl's shirt. Um, oh, it's a little dress. I have all boys. I have all boys, and I'll tell you what, anytime I see a cute little dress, I just want to die. Look how adorable. Oh my god. Oh, it's a 5T. Does, do any of you have a 5T little girl? Because she looks so cute in this. You're going to cry on the video. I'm going to try not to cry on the video because instead I, I mean, you're so cute too, and I love the clothes you're wearing. Like, there's, there's, another. Oh my God! Another cute little girl's dress. Oh. How many dresses are there? I don't know, but that is like the cutest little thing I ever saw. This is more of a Christmas dress, um, but it's still super cute. We've got oh another one of this. Is it a five T? I'd love it if it's the same size. Oh, this is a four T. Um, ugh, these are so cute. We've got a pair of pants. These are Universal Thread, $24.99 originally. This is from Target. Um, $24.99, this is a size 18 mid-rise skinny. Um, but just brown pants. They're, I actually like these. These are cute. I wish they had them in my size. Another adorable dress. Oh my God. So Five tier, four tier. All right. And that is everything. So I'm really happy. Again, the quality of the items it's a is. Two it's a 2T. That's a 2T. The quality quality of the items is perfect. Okay. I, I'm jumping back in real quick because I actually ended the video and I never did like a recap on what I think I'm going to make on this box. So I wanted to do that really quick because I felt kind of silly that I didn't go through that. Um, the shin guards, I've got like 22 or 23 pairs of shin guards total. All of them are selling for around $9.99, $8.99, $10.99. So I feel good about selling those. I don't know how quickly they're gonna move, but I'm very hopeful because we are coming into summer sports season. And so, in total, the um, box cost me 103 Remember, I waited until they sent a, a lower offer. It was $30 shipping, so that's $133. And when I add everything up, this box will make me um, $415.69 minus $133. Equals a total profit on this box of two hundred and eighty-two dollars and sixty-nine cents. Keep in mind, it's a two hundred and eighty-two dollar profit on a hundred and thirty dollar investment. That's significantly easier to list, and that is value as well. Can I put a monetary value on it? I guess there's a monetary value on my time, um, but I wanted to jump in and update with that information because I thought it was kind of important. So. 
I'll finish the video now. Just like last time, um, what I'm really excited about is it's usually not up the same, um, but tomorrow, it is so hard to film with kids. I, I, I like applaud the parents that can do it without getting easily distracted by your kids because it's just, parenting is hard and <laughs> balance is hard and sometimes you just gotta film when the kids are here and look at the shirt <laughs> and it says i love you to buffalo and back i don't know if you guys can see it um quality is awesome tomorrow it's it, it's usually not up there the same day but tomorrow i should be able to go into ebay and my listings will all be right there so tonight before i even put this away i'm going to photograph everything so that tomorrow all I've got to do is basically download those drafts and my drafts are in there and ready to go. All I've got to do is add the photos, update the categories, check the pricing, and um, I, I have plenty to list, which I'm happy about because um, this is a just a seriously easy process for listing. I did have to wait. I mean, I was, I, I go on almost every day and look up and see if I can find any bulk boxes that look like they would work for me. And I had a tough time um, finding, there was a lot of clothes and I'm not really, I know this one's got quite a few clothing items in it, but um, I was more interested in like the sports stuff. So let me know what you guys think. Is this, I, I wanted to try it one more time to see if this was as good as it was the first time. And I am really impressed with the, the quality. Um, this is the way to go, in my opinion. Now, the question is going to be, does this stuff move? And I'm not sure if Franklin's a good mover. Um, I think so, but I guess we're going to find out. I will say the stuff I got from my last bulk box, which was a lot of camping gear and things like that, is moving um, some faster than others. And so... Um, you know, it's eBay. Nothing's going to move right away <laughs> unless it's like rare or you've seriously underpriced it. <laughs> so, um, let me know what you guys thought. I hope you're having a beautiful day. I don't know if it's spring break for you guys, but it is spring break around here. Bye um, guys. Bye from me and Trevor. Thank you for we being. We hope you liked the video. We hope you liked the video. And I've got some photographing to do. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.